Okay. Uh, 12,400 feet or by a little lake. I, I don't know if it's artificial or not, but uh, looking at some uh, various things. So here's the um, lousewort, some columbine. I should probably do a finia, it doesn't have any flowers. Some uh, this little guy that I've yet to identify. Uh, certainly lots of little Russians, these are teeny tiny Russians. Um, this is good. And some asters and some quintiforms that uh, uh, seem to be defying explanation or identification more act. Um, a couple of, uh, there's, um, the pink and the, uh, um, I'm gonna say yellow, but it looks more white here. Um, uh, Indian paintbrush Castellanos. Uh, so, let's see. I'm gonna say sneezeweed. Um, but anyway, so we are... Technically, ecologically speaking, we're above the tree line, I'm going to say. There's still, I see a couple of patches of willows. Um, not sure if I'm going to scale a mountain to look at a willow, but uh, if I pass them. So when everything's shorter here than just a thousand feet lower, um, very bright. There's a speedball too that I've not really taken the time. That's the speedball. Uh, that's in the Scrofularia Sea uh, family, the Snapdragon family. Lots of uh, pen. Uh, just escape my mind. Um, but anyway. That's the willow up there. So it's a little bit sheltered. But anyway, um, primrose, or the shooting star, I'm gonna say. Anyway. But anyway, not too buggy. I'm not, not hit any mosquitoes, certainly. And, um, there are some butterflies and some flies, but uh, for the most part, we're doing pretty good. Some native bees. 